you have to really want it. You know, that's the thing is you have to really, really want to be an artist. I like nails because they're steel, that they're a non-precious material. Everybody seems to have a nail story. They're renovating a house, they find them in the garden, and they've stepped on one. And I like taking that sort of very common material and then sort of interpreting it in a very different way. I like the fact that the steel is hot and I like the physicalness of it and the, the kind of the heavier, big movements that then end up getting kind of transcend into like small goldsmithing movements. There's no such thing as inspiration, you know, it's just it's like work kind of begets work. I think that the best work that I do, it's like writing a novel where you have these characters and they kind of go in these different directions that you didn't expect when you started writing the novel. So that's kind of the way the work is that I build. I mean, I think I have this direction, but then when it's done, it's uh, like some of the characters have died. So it's a little bit like that. You kind of catch lightning in a bottle once, and then it's sort of like, okay, this is what we're doing now. We're catching lightning in a bottle um, every day, and it's a challenge, you know? I mean, I'm legally blind in one eye. I'm like, have learning disabilities, and, you know, I'm not a particularly um, gifted person. It's not magic, it's just work. Maybe if you work enough at it, it does become magic. Mm -hmm.